According to the World Health Organization, there are three basic steps to purify water. First, you've got to remove parasites. Second, you've got to get rid of hazardous chemicals. And third, you need to kill bacteria and viruses. Removing parasites like Giardia and Cryptosporidium is no magic. This requires filtering down to one micron. At 22 microns, a glass of water would look clean. Filtering to one micron is far below that. Municipal systems were designed to move, not to purify water. In Dallas, Texas, we process hundreds of millions of gallons of water per day. Pipes are huge. They are moving water. If Dallas had to filter down to one micron, you might get a drip out of your faucet. Municipal water systems aren't designed to filter to one micron, so parasites like cryptosporidium will pass through. If your immune system is healthy, crypto passes right through. If your immune system is compromised, crypto can attack. It gives off the same symptoms as the flu, and worldwide, a significant percentage of flu deaths are actually cryptosporidium. Filtering to one micron removes those parasites. All of global systems filter to one micron. To remove hazardous chemicals like heavy metals, such as lead mercury, or insecticides, pesticides, radon, etc., most municipal systems use chemicals, flocculation, sand filtrations, and tanks of carbon, like swimming pool treatments. They do not remove all hazardous metals or chemicals. To significantly reduce or eliminate hazardous chemicals, you need two things, and this is not filtration. First, you need to absorb and adsorb those ha hazardous chemicals. You need to grab them. Second, you need retention time. To absorb and adsorb requires media that can grab and hold. But you also need a formula of different media working together. Global's proprietary formula removes hazardous chemicals better than any other. Next, we need retention time. Cities don't have retention time as they move water. Global always has the proper retention time to remove those elements beyond all EPA standards. To kill bacteria and viruses, municipal systems use chlorine. The World Health Organization for 30 years has been telling the world to stop using chlorine. While chlorine can kill viruses and bacteria, when used in water that is not cleaned, as we just explained, it creates carcinogens. You drink the water today without getting sick, but it can kill you in the long run with cancer. A significant percentage of world deaths from cancer are from the water. Global uses ultraviolet to kill bacteria and viruses. So Global uses all three principles for purification in every water treatment system it builds. Filtration to one micron to remove parasites, adsorption and absorption to remove hazardous chemicals, and ultraviolet to kill bacteria and viruses, creating the best quality water in the world. Every system that Global manufactures follows Water 101, whether we are purifying fresh water, brackish water, seawater, or wastewater.